Let's not forget me, forget me, forget me, forget me, forget me, forget me, forget me. Yeah, hey, boy. Yeah. You guys are probably wondering why I'm level 7 at the moment. I can tell you that right now. So, if you are building in Minecraft in a tunnel or a cave, make sure to light it up because <laughs> you'll never know when a creeper will creep in and get your but that, that, that's kind of sad but i learned my lesson we learned our lesson so yeah um but yeah nonetheless uh this is where we'll be starting the video hello everyone and welcome back to minecraft this is the sixth part of the series and i hope you guys enjoyed i have gone ham on this part because i have done so much in the past two days i have not recorded in two days and oh my freaking gosh, the build, I can tell you guys, I can proudly present to you guys, I can present to you guys that the transit system is online and I'll show you that in a minute. So let's go ahead and tour the whole place. I changed a few things. I have been mining inside the mine and also outside because I needed tons of cobblestone and rail parts to do the rail system. So this is Jeff's room. Uh, it's a little bit cozier than last time. He only had one window, but now that he has uh, a bigger slot to look out of then uh that'll be fine i haven't turned him into a librarian yet because i haven't uh i have the materials to do it but i'll probably do it now in this video so uh we'll do it together you guys will do it together and turn him into a librarian so all right um let's see oh yeah so where did i put my Yeah, here we go paper <laughs> okay so i have paper and okay so we don't have enough i think uh we need more than this to make a book can't remember exactly is this oh my gosh oh no that recipe was actually for uh sugar cane paper and book i think uh let me check Maybe we can check the crafting thingy. A uh, book. Let me type that in. Book. So to make a book, we need leather and paper. So we got that. We do have that. So we can make two books. There we go. Uh, also, just grab my stuff before dying. As you can see, I got steak. I finally did the farm. I'll show you guys in a minute or so. Let's just do this first. Let's make a book. And voila! So, lectern. We need a bookshelf. So how do we make a bookshelf? Jeez. Okay, game. I don't have it memorized, but yeah. So we need three books. We need one more. We got tons of stuff. Okay, I'll show you guys. I am so excited to show you guys this one. So is this where I put it? I think I think I'll just put it. Now nah, let's put it here instead. Okay. So right. I do have the leather there? Right. So steel doors. And look at that. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I did do the steel doors uh, on a previous video um, the reason why I added a second line of defense because um, while I was doing this whole place right here zombies were actually trying to spawn in or trying to get into the house because it is actually pressure Pre yeah it's pressure it's pressurized so even zombies can walk through it and open the door, which is uh, kind of what I didn't want to happen. My earbuds are falling out of place. Alright, so I added a second line of defense since I know zombies are stupid enough not to open doors. 
So where should we start? Okay, so um, maybe I should start here. I planted some trees. I chopped these trees down from there and then added more trees, uh, saplings here. You can see the transit now. That's going to be awesome. I'll show you uh, to you fully later. Uh, yeah, so this is the whole area here. Um, yeah, you can see here that I made a farmland down there. It's a work in progress. You can see that there's a tower there. So when you enter this place, there's like a little cool, um, I don't know what you call this. Oh, it's almost nighttime, but we're, we'll be safe in here, I guess. So it's like a little tower up there. We can, uh, look through and uh, see if there's like any enemies close to us. Also, we got here really good defense if we got any enemies close we can definitely like try to shoot them also i was um i was visited by those raiders actually the guys with banners and uh, crossbows i got their loot which is um i put it here i think you saw you saw it earlier but if you haven't then i got a crossbow from them i put it in storage first for safekeeping let's put down the bed uh, my inventory is kind of messed up because of uh, the creeper explosion. So I was... The bed was supposed to be here. And then actually slept. I The reason why I made a upstairs here is because I wanted to go to Jeff and uh, like... Maybe, okay, this is the thing here. I build a ladder up here, and um, this is like the pathway. So I'll try to make like a villager section here. So it's not like, it's not like it's only Jeff that will be living here. This is just Jeff's quarters, but I still don't know if I should be putting it here or not. But what I had in mind was that I will be expanding this place, and there will be like other other people there in a row so like this is going to be like the library the other row is going to be like a blacksmithing area the other place is going to be like a what other things or professions that the villagers can do mostly we'll add them all into this little line here so it's you can see it like it's like building a small community underground with uh the kingdom of okondom so um, I'll try not to stray away far from the immersion of the forge or the hearth, as I call it. Uh, you know, actually, for immersion's sake, I think we'll take out Jeff from here. We'll move him once we can get like some sort of a place to put like a library system, maybe somewhere around the the area here but uh, it really depends on how I build stuff I really do it as I go so this is Jeff's place for now this is going to be his small little library where we can put the, the, down the lantern I'm mean, not lantern but the lectern and then we can see if like there's any sort of enchantment that we can grab like uh, um, unbreaking mending or uh, fortune but yeah some other things for the books and whatnot and also the enchanting table right here so we can check for enchantments so yeah i was saying like if we expand this it has to be like some sort of smith's place like it has to be immersive as hell um i'm pretty proud of the build so far because it's slowly getting there it's slowly turning into a really nice community which is uh just which is what i'm I've been aiming for so far so this looks like a really like small outpost slash uh, castle-like, I guess. But it's not as big as a castle, which I know most um, most of you Minecrafters or the pro veterans of Minecraft have already done a build like this, but which is which is tons better than mine. So yeah. Um, up here is like the, the place where you can look out of... This is like the transit system that I was saying. Um, this is the transit project chest. I... From all the excavation of cobblestone from the mines downstairs. And also, I'll show you in a bit, I mined the area pretty badly. And uh, I haven't really fixed it, but I might probably fix it. Actually, let me just try and show you real quick. 
since it's close enough. Actually, this place right here, was a small hill uh, looking through the valley. But uh, yeah, so that's what happened. That's the aftermath of what happened. I actually plan on maybe in the long run of the series, I don't know when, maybe like not in the next part or not in the next 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 part, but this is like the really long term um, long term build as well, like a really big project in Minecraft is uh, I thought of like, um, this is like giving me like a Naruto vibe, like this is like the hidden village or something, like I'll put like a face here. It'll be look like a monument. It's gonna look so awesome. Uh, so yeah, uh, this is the railway system or the transit system going to uh, the ocean or the beach. Uh, it's not as fancy as you might think it would be, but it is functional. So that's the main goal of mine uh, uh, building this during uh, the past two days. I will try to make it better, I promise. The, the This is the reason why I rushed this. If I didn't rush it, I'd probably not have this part of the video out so soon. So yeah, the past two days, this is what I've been doing. Mining cobblestone and iron and as well as looking for redstone. But yeah, so um, I'm so glad that I didn't use all, uh, like all of the materials here. This used to be so full, and we only had like three shovels left and an uh, one, three, four, five, six, six pickaxe left, including this one. But this is already used. So yeah, uh, a few cobblestone stacks, and that should be good enough. So this is the items that I used to build the transit system. We'll try to uh, use the rail cart going there or the mine cart going to the other side. Um, this is the furnace that I used. Like I needed a lot to rush this project or to make it a little bit faster and use it efficiently. I had tons of uh, furnaces here so that I can smelt iron pretty fast. So if you can see here on the left side, this is going to be the animal farm to the left and the watchtower on the right. Let's go to the watchtower first on the right. So as you can see this, um, I'll try to fill this in. Uh, I know like people can just jump over if this was like PvP or something. But yeah, uh, so far the AI hasn't really tried to do anything like that. I'll show you on top of the watchtower here, so I can overlook the valley here. This is pretty cool. You can see over here, and that is so awesome. Oh yeah, so that's a farmland that that's kind of spoiled you guys. So okay, let's go there now. I'm kind of bummed because I lost to a freaking creeper that exploded right in my face though. But yeah, um, I needed the levels. That would have been really good with the levels if I had some. So this is the farmland going up here. I added one sapling on each uh, farm pen. So that is a cow pen and this is the sheep pen. So far it's only sheep and cows at the moment. I also tried to make a storage area for the animal need center. It's called animal need center. I don't know why but yeah. Don't cringe too much. I need to feed these guys. Hello guys, you want some foodie? Come on, repopulate! Repopulate! Okay, make babies. Here guys, time to eat. Okay, now that that's done, um, yeah. Let's put back the wheat. Put that there. So this is the area. I also want to try and cover this up because I know monsters can just jump down and kill the animals, so... That's a work in progress. Um, I went like all over the place with this. Like, I'm not gonna lie. If I focused on one thing, it'll probably look better. But so far, I needed one at a time. And uh, this is like, I'll just put the foundation and the layout and maybe like I'll try to detail it and uh, form it into a better looking uh, structure. So, right. That being said, let's go down here. Let's go to the farmlands. It's not much, but uh, we're growing some weed over here. It's pretty cool. 
uh, farm storage center everything that is farm related to plant and whatnot sugar canes this is what we'll use to make more books let's go ahead and grab them right now and we should be good all right so i've been watching tons of uh, minecraft lately on youtube and one thing that i actually want to do in this series also is try to make a some sort of an automatic uh like i'll try to efficiently use the redstone and make contraptions because i know how crazy you can get with those things like use pistons and uh try to make uh stuff automatically receivers like uh, automatic receivers whatnot we'll need that uh sugar cane okay so um what did i miss i did show you the f animal form watchtower yeah let's go ahead and get the minecart and let's go ahead and ride this thing okay so are you guys ready let's go do a countdown right shall we let's go so we're gonna go in 10 9 8 7 6 Five, four, three, two, one, and let's go! I'm excited! Woohoo! This is fun! This is fun! I should have brought the bed. But yeah. Woohoo! <laughs> awesome! Oh, uh, that, that's so beautiful. Sunset. Me in the cart. And welcome to Isla Paraiso. So, this is what I named the place. Uh, right. And this is the ladder going down. I, oh, <laughs> I forgot to take out the dirt over there. But yeah, the, we, can, uh, we can definitely do that again sometime um let's try to at least we already have this small project thank you sipster hd for telling me that we can do a small project like this um i didn't really think much of it but uh thanks for the the tip and advice for this and um, i know most of you agreed as well so we'll be making our house or we'll be creating our house there by the beach so that we can go on uh, sea adventure or sea expedition. But yeah. Uh, so far, that is cool. So that's one part of the transit done. Long term would be the transit going to the village. But I think that would be actually really stupid though. Because we can use the water. Or we can use the water place, or the ocean rather. Sorry, I'm, my mind's like dialoping right now. So we can use the ocean to travel to that place, to the village. So I don't think we'll need to use that. So, okay. What will we do today? We're going to make some books. Let's go ahead and uh, do the books now. All right, I think I'll need more wood. Let's go ahead and chop some trees. Do I have more? Okay, I forgot. My my stuff is all over the place. It, it's it's kind of annoying that it's all over the place. I'll need to bring some stuff back. Oh gosh, I wonder if I can just. Rem yeah, I don't have any more ingots. Because I was gonna say though, because maybe I could just definitely. Yeah, I could just definitely just uh, dismantle these things and get a few items back. Okay, so maybe I'll just put the iron picks here and the shovels. Okay. So I'm going to make an axe and let's go ahead and get some wood. <laughs> I'm actually pretty 
low-key excited doing this right now. I don't know. Like, after building for the past few days, I think I was gonna go insane. So I'm just so happy that I'm gonna be continuing this. And I hope that... Uh, I don't have any more iron doors. Jeez. Okay. Alright. So, maybe I should make... Maybe I should make another a trapdoor instead. Just make a trap door and then just so that he won't run away. Okay, once this does okay, go back inside. Oh my god, get back in. Go in. Jeff. 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 Get back inside, please. Jeff. Inside. Jeff, inside, inside, please go in, Jeff. Oh my gosh! Oh no! No 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 no! Oh f f <laughs> no! God damn it! Jeff, get back here! Oh my god! Jesus. Okay, fine. Ow! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 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 Have a cobblestone. Okay. Now he is. Loyalty? What? What's loyalty? What the freak is loyalty? Oh my god, Jeff. Think of what you've done. Be a good boy and think of what you've done. Okay. We can... Uh, hey, Jeff. Hello, hello. Okay. So, that's good enough. Um, what did they do? Oh. Okay, if I want to trade with him, yeah, we can reach. We can definitely reach him. That's good. Okay, so... Loyalty. Huh. Kind of disappointed though, but uh, that's fine. So, right. Since we already have the boat today, we're going to go ahead and go on adventure. Let's uh, look past the seas and see what is on the other side of the world. And since we have paper, do we have extra paper? No. Um, let's put the paper here. Oak slabs and the bookshelf. Okay, oak slabs, let's put it here. Honestly, I've gotten immune to those sounds, so it's just annoying at this point. So, I guess we'll need dirt. We'll just need dirt for in case we have a, an experience with whatever somewhere. Let's grab cobblestone too. Um, should we bring the bed? I think we should bring the bed. Wait. Um, oh shoot. Jeff. That's... Oh gosh. That's what I needed. I was saying how come I have an extra bed? Okay. Okay. Are you happy? Oh, he's sleeping. That's awesome. So while he's sleeping, I can see we can definitely do this. Oh gosh, I hear zombies. Is it? Is it here? Oh my god, a creeper. Oh frick. What the hell? Game? What the hell? Why is there a freaking creeper? Was that zombie above? No, he's not above. That's good. Okay. Yeah. Alright, so why is there a freaking creeper in the mine? I don't want to explode once again. So I guess we'll just try to sleep. And I was going to say that we're going to go on an adventure. Okay, so zombie is uh, on top. That's good. Alright, so let's get steak. Just to make sure that our... Do, do I have extra coal? Did I use all my coal on the iron? Frick, damn it. I think that should be good enough. Th 25 is good enough. I think we can find more coal in the, f in the distant lands, I guess. Alright, that's good enough. So... Let's, uh... 
Let's go. And I'm kind of excited to go to the ocean. <laughs> so this is this is where we'll set uh, the house. I don't know which part yet, but I'm probably next or near the the transit. So I don't think we'll need this anymore. That's extra wood that we need too. You know what? I should have brought the frick. <laughs> I should have brought the treasure map. God dang it. Okay, let's go back. Hello, Jeff. Silk touch. Silk touch? Oh, he changes per day. That's good. So I can... I can... I can make a really big farm of... Uh... Paper. And then we can probably try to wait for... The enchantments to pop out. Okay, that would be pretty good. I thought it was permanent, but actually it's not. So... That's good to know, too. Okay. So... We don't- I don't see the dot anymore. So... I don't know what's- what's wrong. I don't know what's wrong. There's a dolphin there, too. Okay, let's see... What the world has in store for us. I want to go to third person because it looks a little bit cleaner. And I can see afar, too. So we're just gonna go south. Remember to come back north, I guess. I should have made a compass, you know, actually. There's sugar cane here, might as well grab it. Oh gosh. The water is so deep. I wonder if we'll ever find a water temple though. Maybe somewhere there, but uh, eventually, I guess. Eventually. Is that a sunken boat down there? That must be a sunken boat. Yeah, it is. It definitely is. Oh, wow. Wow. Yo, the treasure was actually pretty, f pretty close. Also, I want to check down there. I'm kind of scared, though. Yeah. Is that the is that boat or is that water? Yeah, that's a that's a freaking wreck. That is a wreck. I'll go to it probably in the future. I don't have the equipment to scuba dive, but that is good enough to know that uh, there's actually one nearby. So this is actually just a big circle of ocean near our place. So we, we can't really get lost unless we go all the way south here. Because the... Okay. We haven't really ventured a lot, but all I can say is that... This is a really big circle. North of it is our place. And that is a small portion of the entrance going south. So I guess... Uh, I guess that's good enough. That's really good. Okay, the treasure should be here. Oh? Oh, hell yeah. It's probably somewhere here. So glad I brought a shovel, though. It should definitely be here. Somewhere here, by the by the sand. So, let's get to... Digging. There's definitely something here. Mm-hmm, that's sand. Oh, here we go! <laughs> yes, boy! Oh! Heart of the Sea? Iron ingot, Emeralds, TNT, cooked salmon. Who the hell puts cooked salmon inside a chest, a buried chest? Yeah, it's, it's good to know that there's a really big ocean here. See, th I'm, I'm, this is what I'm saying. Like, this is just going like a full circle. My chunks didn't really load it, but you can definitely get or point out uh, what I'm trying to say. Like this part over here just goes for a full circle, going to that small entrance to the south. And also here, right going all the way to the south, like the small entrance over there. So you will not get really, you won't really get lost here. That's, that's, that's pretty good. 
So, I'm happy with that expedition. Let's see. I mean, we can keep the boat there. So, alright. So, I actually got excited with the Heart of the Sea, which I got from the chest or the buried treasure. Was because that this Heart of the Sea means that once we can get some shells and combine it with Heart of the Sea, we can actually make a conduit. The conduit is actually some sort of device that helps us in the water and helps us attack mobs too. So yeah, uh, not only does it help us with mobs underwater, it also helps us breathe underwater too. So that is fun. I just looked it up on Wiki. I don't really memorize all of it though, but yeah. I'll just keep the cobblestone there. Uh, sorting out the whole place would still be a work in progress. But I'm just glad so far that I've made it possible. So, what was I gonna do? I am going to... Yeah, let me just... Let me go and uh, grab some sugarcane. Let's just uh, put most of the items uh, into our chests for now. And we are going to go ahead and go down to the cave. Please don't freaking creep on me when it blew up in my face like last time. Okay. So. In that retrospective. That is where we went to. This used to be like just this. Just a wall. I actually made a really, really long way down here. To grab some cobblestone as well as iron at the same time you know just gather the materials that we needed to create the transit system oh gosh there's an enderman down there I definitely heard that okay so I haven't really much ventured into this part of the alley I didn't really pay that much attention to gold last time, but oh my gosh, when I needed to make the transit systems rail, I needed gold so badly, I tried to look for it non-stop. And which is why this is a good change in the system. Like, I was building non-stop for the past few days. Why is that like a different growl than usual though? Like, that is a different growl than usual zombie growl. That is definitely a different zombie growl. Is there... Yo, that is a... That is a zombie villager. And there's tons of creepers down there. Come here, bro. Uh, Let's make a... Yeah, maybe we can put him in here. Go down there. Get down there. Get down there. Oh my god, before I kill you. Oh shit. Freaking creeper. Fuck, don't kill me. No. Ah. God damn it. Stupid creeper. God damn creeper. I was saving that guy. I was gonna save that guy. What the hell, dude? Stupid little shit. Just stay there. Stay there. How dare you. Ow! Oh my god, get away! Fick! Oh my god, there's more of them. Oh, god damn it, what the hell, dude? It's okay, there's more experience for us. What the feck, dude? How many are there of you? What? Is there like a freaking spawner right here? Holy shit. That was a freaking annoying. Oh my god. There's more of you. I'm gonna... I'm gonna cover that up because that was annoying. Grab this flesh. 
Okay, there's more creepers down there. Oh, explode! Come on. Boop. 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 Come on. Boop. Dude, what the frick? Okay, I definitely should have made a shield. I'm so stupid. That's fine. Got 50. That's sweet. Oh, there's more emeralds here. I don't want monsters to spawn. Please don't spawn. Please don't spawn. Wait, is this where? Holy shit. This is, this is going around. Okay, this is going around. There's more of you little shits. Okay, that was the place where we blocked earlier. God damn. What the frick? Where are you coming from? Then let's open it then, since, uh... Yeah, so this is good going around. That's good to know. We got tons of iron, which is, uh... I love... <gasps> Finally. Oh, <laughs> we found some diamonds. Hell yeah. My pick broke. Oh, sweet. That's four diamonds, man. That's four diamonds. That's awesome. Ow. What the hell? That hasn't happened in a long time. That's annoying. I freaking hate the sounds of Minecraft. Okay, let's do that. The branching method is really good, though. So, alright. So, as for diamonds, you just want to go to around 11 up until, I don't know, 12. But it's debatable to 11 to 13. But yeah, if you want to do this, you can start from here. Mining diamonds. We can do it as a branching method. So, as far as your mi mine pick can go, so your mining pick, as far as it can go, and then go for four blocks. So, one, two, three, four. And then just keep going. Okay. Like, most of the time, it'll be really fast to gr uh, look for some diamonds. So, then one, two, three, four. And we found some redstone over there. So just keep going. Keep mining. So yeah, always be careful when mining through here. Because that's... That's going to be really... You're going to be really sorry once... Uh, once you f fall down into lava. Ah. See? See, see, see? We're still in oven. Ah, there you go. See? That was so cool. I told you. I'm a Minecraft veteran. Okay. Let's go ahead and grab that. Uh, let's put some torches first. And... Okay. So let us mine this. Oh my god, that's it? It's gotta be more, bro. What the hell? There's only one block of diamond? Bruh. What the hell was that? 
Why? <laughs> Why? Why is there only one block of diamond there? There should be another cave system here. Oh, wow. Wow! Ooh, there's cobblestone there. Oh, you know what that means? There's a spawner here. There's definitely a spawner here. What? Okay. Oh, shit. What spawner is this? Oh, it's a zombie spawner. It's a zombie spawner. The most basic spawners ever. Oh, shit. Luck of the sea! I know that doesn't mean much, but... Still, though. It's better than nothing. Okay. Oh, we got iron ores armor. Armor. Armor, too. Cool. An ingot, string, gunpowder. Don't need wheat. We got tons of wheat at home. That's awesome. So, this is a really far place. We are at 14, and I don't know if I can remember the place going down here. It's always good to know that there's a spawner somewhere in the world. I might... Okay. I might try to mine all the way up. Considering I have tons of cobblestone. Okay, I'll just... I'll do just that. Because I really, really need a spawner. And the zombie spawner is my luck. Like, that's the luckiest find today. Because we'll need that for experience. Okay. And hopefully we can find a cave going up. Because that's going to be tons useful. But it's always good to know that there's a spawner here. Like, that's the best. That's the best ever. We're definitely going to make a way going down here. And hopefully I can find a way back to the house. That's like top priority going back to the house. So, we can also put the transit system. Putting a way going down here. I hear, I hear the top. I hear rain. It's the it's raining right now. We're so close. For all we know, we're we've already hit top level and this we're just mining We're just mining on top of a, a mountain or something. I see ground. Is that ground or gravel? That's that's definitely Oh I hear. Ooh. I didn't bring a bed. Okay. I hear zombies too. I don't want to die with all this stuff on me. Uh, goodbye granite. Okay. And the thing is, we don't even know where we are in the world. Oh, there's, there's top already. My gosh, okay. We're gonna we're gonna have to rush. Yo bro, where are we? No way. Do I Is it where I think it is? I think it is where I think it is. Okay, okay, I know where we are. I freaking know where we are. Please don't die. I know where we are. I know where we are. Let's head here. To the west side? Yeah, those are the pumpkins from... From from where we were ex doing an expedition, going to the... Oh! Frick, yes, dude! This is so close to the house! Oh, we can definitely make a, a transit system going here. Or we can just definitely walk, though. Oh, that is so freaking awesome! That's awesome! Oh my gosh, this, a freaking spawner is just there. Who would have known? That is so cool. So we got tons of cobblestone again and a tons of iron. That's good. 
that's a good run. I hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, we're going to continue that in the next part of the video. But uh, yeah, nevertheless, I'm going to be building us another transit system going to that place. And um, here's a treat. I'll probably build it with you guys since you did not have the honor of seeing me build the transit system going to the ocean. I'll be building it uh, in the next part of the video. So yeah. We'll be building a transit system going there and also some stairs going down to uh, the spawner. And I'm so excited because that spawner is going to help us level and we're going to be using enchanting items soon. I can feel it. I can definitely feel it. This is amazing. This is awesome. Okay, that's enough about that. We're babbling too much. So that's going to be it for us today, guys. I hope you enjoyed that part of the video so if you like what you saw please leave a like share and subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel uh you can check out my minecraft series and my skyrim series in the channel and also if you're not into gaming i have a tutorial video on how i do my thumbnails but yeah nevertheless like share and subscribe and uh, i will see you guys again in the next part of the video